This is a partial list of drugs that prolong your QT interval. There are antiarrhythmics like amiodarone, procainamide, quinidine, and sodalol. Antipsychotics like chlorpromazine and haloperidol. Antimicrobials like clarithromycin and erythromycin. And other meds like arsenic, uh, droperidol, glycopyrrolate, methadone, ondansetron or zofran, and volatile anesthetics, which have a dose-dependent response. Some patients are predisposed to having prolonged QT. They can have long QT syndrome, which is an inherited disorder caused by mutations in genes encoding cardiac, sodium, and potassium channels. These have increased risk of ventricular arrhythmias, namely dorsades de point. Hypocalcemia and hypomagnesemia also prolong your QT interval, hence your treatment with IV magnesium if you ever do see torsades. The etiology is abnormal depolarizations that interrupt phases 2, 3, or 4 of the cardiac action potential, so phases 2, 3, and 4. Lastly, the treatment for this would be beta blockers. You can also use an IAICD or cardiac pacemaker if the beta blocker doesn't work or is for otherwise contraindicated.